Welcome back. Well, let's uh, get started with our management calls. And Maruti is the first management on the show. The company's November sales came in line, aided by the SUV segment. Joining us now to talk about the outlook, we have with us uh, Partho Banerjee, Senior Executive Director, Marketing and Sales at Maruti Suzuki India. Mr. Banerjee, great to have you on. Thank you very much for joining us. So let's talk about the demand sentiment on ground. And, you know, the festive season was, I think, okay for most uh, OEMs. But how are things looking now? I think the last month was pretty good for us. Uh, we saw a very good traction in terms of booking. In fact, I would say the festival season impact is still on. We are seeing a very good sort of interaction and response from the rural market. Rural market has been doing pretty well. We are seeing it is increasing to the tune of 2.7%. Now our penetration of rural market is 48%. In terms of numbers, if you talk about it, uh, we had a dispatch growth of almost 5%. And if we see the one uh, numbers for the retail, October plus November, because this year Diwali was in the month of October. Last year it was in the month of November. So if we take both this month cumulatively together, October plus November, our one market share growth, uh, retail growth is 10.8%. Hi, Mr. Banerjee. Thanks a lot for joining in. Well, considering the continued growth post the festive season, do you still maintain the retail sales outlook of around 3 to 4% growth for the year? Or are you expecting to do better than that now? If we see the retail growth for this year in the industry from April to November, it's around 4%. So I think uh, the beginning of the year, Siam did a projection that the industry will grow at the rate of 3 to 4 percent since the base was very high so i think industry is going absolutely as per the forecast which was made in the beginning of the year and i feel uh, the year will be ending at around 3 to 4 percent only right uh, you know we've seen an increased level of discounting during the festive season and again we are entering this uh, period i mean which is the end of the year discounts usually go up uh, demand is yet to recover fully uh, do you see an increased trend in, uh, I mean, manufacturers reaching towards discounts as a strategy to push sales? Mm -hmm. You rightly said. Uh, I think everybody waits for the month of December. There is generally a tendency for the consumer to wait till the month of December to buy the car. So it's too early, just the beginning of the month. But what we are seeing is this, the response is pretty positive actually from the market. So we are expecting that December will be a good retail month. Okay, all right. Um, so if we talk about uh, you know the sales over the last couple of months, they've been indicating continued momentum in the SUV segment. I mean, that's the part of the market that's doing really well for most automakers, right? What is your uh, you know total share of SUV uh, as the as your own pie, and also as in terms of market share? Where are you with respect to SUVs? Yeah, I think uh, today if we see the segmentation of the market based on the form, so you are right, SUV segment share has moved up from 50% to now 54.6% industry. And Maruti has moved from 24% to 27.6%. So we are also continuously improving our share in the SUV segment. However, I would like to just say one thing that there are other form factors also and other segments also like the hatches, premium hatches, MPVs, like Artiga is doing very well MPV segment. We are seeing that last month, in fact, the Bellino is the number one selling model the month of November. Swift in the month of October did a retail of more than 22,000 vehicles. So we are seeing that Across the segments also, there are consumers who are looking forward to buy the cars. But nevertheless, right now, the share of the SUV segment is increasing, actually. All right, Mr. Banerjee, last month you announced the fourth generation Desire. Could you give us a sense about how demand for the Desire has been so far? I think Desire has, we are seeing a very good response. Uh, we are having now... Uh, beginning of this month we are having close to 25000 bookings pending bookings with us uh, and if we see how has been our booking growth it has almost doubled actually after the launch we launched it on 11th of november 
So earlier we used to get around 500 bookings per day. Now it is on average 1000 bookings per day. That's the response. And another important thing which we are seeing, it's too early, but I think there's a positive sign. The top two variants booking is coming close to 50%, which earlier used to be around 21, 22%. So that's a very good sign. The features which we have introduced in those model has been very much appreciated by the consumers. So they are more and more going towards the higher variants. Okay. All right. Uh, got that. Uh, Mr. Banerjee, we'll leave it, on, leave it on that note. Thank you very much for joining in. Take a quick break, come back on the other side. Siddharth Kemka of Motilal Oswal Financial Services will join in with some specific stock ideas.